my dears what is up i am your favorite purple lady amethyst lady and we are back with another awesome stream i hope everyone is doing very well today we're going to be playing more persona 3 reload today i hope you are ready for more awesome uh jrpg goodness and i hope you're doing very well it is thursday and we are chilling um this is going to be a very chillax stream so kick back relax grab your snacks and uh, we're going to go right in. But I do want to advise and remind everyone that next week, next week is the, um, we're going to be doing fundraising for gamers outreach. So that's going to be really, really cool. So pretty much the next time I go live next week um, from Tuesday to Thursday, at least we'll be live all three days. It will be fundraising and it will be most excellent okay so yeah um without further ado oh you definitely want to be there for it because uh yeah <laughs> i'm probably going to be playing if all goes to plan i'm going to be playing something i've never played before just for the occasion but all right so um let's get in there i'm gonna zoom All right, we're at the title screen. Let me just uh, put my little self over here. And there we go. Good, good, good. <clears throat> Pardon me. All right, let me do this. Shooby dooby doo. Just uh, taking care of a couple things really quick. Sorry, y'all. I apologize. All right. <clears throat> okay. Without further ado, let's get in there. Now, I do want to advise. I did some grinding off stream, so now I have some um, pretty cool personas, and my people are of a good strength. I would say. So we'll see how far we can go. Do 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 do. Mm -hmm. Do 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 do. But yeah, I'll show you. So these are my personas. I have Oberon, Tam Lin, Jack Frost. Jack O' Lantern, Inugami. Inugami is the newest one. Uh, Pisaka and Unicorn. I had to get Unicorn again because I fused Unicorn. Unicorn is like learned everything that Unicorn can learn. So yes, the Inugami is the um, the newest one. So all right, we're gonna go ahead and leave. I got some really good grinding done. Yes. Let's call it quits. We are done with that. And now it is the fifth. I can hear people talking. Have you heard? I heard from a younger guy in my club yesterday that a second year is getting bullied. Huh? That's crazy. Which second year? I don't know. All I heard is that it's pretty serious. Uh-oh. I thought our school was peaceful, but I guess stuff like that still happens here. That's not good. Someone in the same grade as me is getting bullied? We can't have that. All right, let's see here. Quiet down, class. It's time to begin today's lecture. Uh, pro Gridio Adio Lucem Sidrum. I'm changing today's lecture to another integrated learning one since Mr. Okoda left earlier today. He claimed he wasn't feeling too well. Looked fine enough to me, though. Quick word of caution. Make sure you know what you're eating before you take a bite. I covered the basics of learning magic last time. So today I'll go a bit deeper into meditation 
First, let's review the ways that magicians will meditate. To heighten the creative impulse, the source of all your magical power, observe a real world object carefully, then recreate it in your mind down to the last tiny detail. That's the Western standard for meditation, but I like to talk about the Eastern style as well. Meditation was originally refined in the East and modern magicians adapted Eastern meditation for their own original style. You find the right posture, take a deep breath in and out and calm your mind. That's the basic practice of the Eastern style. It doesn't take much to practice meditation either. All you need is some free time and a relatively calm environment. It doesn't take long, but you should give yourself at least 15 minutes for a proper session. Now for the specifics. First, your posture. Just take a position that you find comfortable. Sitting cross-legged is good enough for most, but you can try the full lotus position too. It's sometimes called kekafusa. You can even meditate while sitting in a chair. Any position works as long as it's comfortable. Once your breathing is relaxed, close or cover your eyes and let the rest of your body relax too. Now that you've prepared yourself physically, you'll focus next on your mind and soul. Imagine a symbol, some simple image, perhaps a large tree or the moon. It could even be the god of your own faith if you like. However, do not force yourself to fully empty your mind. That's actually a common misconception. Most people aren't even capable of it, but succeeding is especially dangerous. You run the risk of losing all control of yourself. I'm feeling sleepy. <laughs> Should I close my eyes? No, we need to stay awake. We need to be smart. That is to say. So what have we learned? Meditation could be aided through iconography rather than forcing an empty mind. Hmm. <clears throat> Even Christian prayer can reach a level of meditation if practiced fervently enough. Although in that case, the imagined symbol is present for a reason other than meditational aid. It can be dangerous to plumb the depths of your consciousness, but by keeping a clear symbol in mind, you avoid teetering over the edge and plunging into darkness. Go ahead and try meditating tonight if you'd like. All right, that's it for today. I forced myself to stay away. Yeah. Yes, yes, yes. We are smarter for it, but still above average. Hopefully it goes up soon. Hmm? teach those first years how to clean up properly mm. hmm <laughs> <laughs> Uh -oh. I pretended to take a picture with my cell phone and she totally freaked out and started crying. Uh, something tells me this might be the bully. It was like we caught her red handed or something. You should have seen the look on her face. It was priceless. Wow, that's pathetic. <laughs> I've never laughed so hard in all my life. <laughs> there 
making fun of someone? Hmm. Bullies. Yeah. Huh? Did you hear a voice? It's calling me. Hmm? Huh? What voice? I don't hear anything. Oh. Uh, Maki? What's going on? Are you listening to me? Uh. Maki? Uh oh. Hello? Hmm. Something's going on. Huh? They're finally gone. Ugh, I can't stand girls like that. Hmm. All right, class is ended. Let's see what's going on. First and foremost, work related sewing machine. Good for your skin. Quality coffee. <laughs> I need to go to the track team. It's been a while. You seem to know Kurijo san, but you're not going after her, are you? Not particularly. I think I already talked to that guy though. I'm probably going to track team today. What's today? Friday? Hmm. I want to check him on the tree. Huh? Damn, she's so persistent. She must have some kind of iron will to follow me around this much. She'd make a great detective. <laughs> oh my God, did you see that? He just threw a rock at a bird resting on that branch. That's so cruel. Oh. He might not be all that she thought he was I know that feeling hmm let's see here Hmm. No, no. I need to go to the shrine. I need to go to the shrine. Then I need to go to the mall to get some new equipment and stuff. Yeah. Let me see here. Ooh, this is light damage to all. I should probably make another gorilla, maybe? Hmm. Rebellion might be worth it. I've got three. <laughs> I've got three regenerate. All right. I just need to make sure, like, of which one I want. Hmm. Maybe I'll get another rebellion, though.
let me see here next i need to go to the mall I know this guy from when I was your age. He's a grave digger. He told me when you die, I'll dig you a fine big grave. It was nice of him. Good friends are a blessing. They really are. That's nice, actually. A bit morbid, but nice. Oh, yeah. All right. Let's see. So first we're going to sell... We have a lot of like stuff we can sell. Hopefully we get a good chunk of change. That's nice. Oh, uh, we almost hit 69,420 yen. <laughs> we were very close. All done here. All right. Um, is there any weapons that we need? There's no weapons I can buy that will be higher. There's no armor I can buy that would be higher. There's no boots I can buy that would be higher. And then I would just have to check the accessories. You finished? Come back soon. I need to do a shop at the pharmacy when there's a sale but i can't right now um let's try um the station outskirts okay Hmm. Nothing here. All right, let's go here. <clears throat> Pardon me. All right, that's a no. All right, yeah, I need to go to track practice. Let's meet up with them. Hey there. Yo, finally exams are over. Woo. What's the plan for today? Oh, speaking of which, you gonna head to practice? Sorry, man. Go on ahead without me. What? He's acting strangely. What's going on? Yeah, I definitely need to spend some time with him. Yeah, I'm gonna head over to just give me a sec. I don't see Miyamoto. Well, we're out of here. Hmm. Hmm, wonder what's going on. I made my way back to the dorm after practice. I wonder what's going on. Hmm? Oh. Dang, nice bag. What's up? I was just gonna sneak back into practice. Hmm. Where have you been? He'd never ditch. My mom's been on my case. Oh. Uh... She took me to the hospital. She insisted after I told her about my knee. Ah, uh, yeah, that'll do it. She made the appointment without telling me, so there was nothing I could do. Ah. Uh... That. How did it go? Hell if I know. What? Did you go? Sorry. I know you're just worried about me. 
Oh, man. Today they took some x-rays. They'll give me the results in a few days. Hmm. Not sure why that has to take so long. Yeah, I don't know either. Oh, hey. Don't tell anyone about me going to the hospital, right? Okay. I'm counting on you. I feel bad for always asking you to keep things quiet. Sorry about that. It's okay, friendo. He seems appreciative of me. And we're becoming closer. It's all right. All right. The doctor told me to take it easy today, but you should still get to practice. No. Oh, wait, if you're leaving, that means practice is already over. Yep, it's already over. Well, I guess I'll just go home. Hmm. See ya. See ya, bro. Ah! And I decided to go back to the dorm. Poor thing. Welcome back. What's up, dude? Well, what's this mail? Huh? What? He wants to go get something to eat? Akihiko? Sure. Hey, so God, I hate bullying. Even just seeing it happens to someone else, it just feels as bad. I feel the same. Yeah. Right? I overheard these girls today talking about how they were picking on someone. I couldn't tell who they were talking about or anything though. I wish I could do something. Oh, am I able to put my food in the fridge? Oh, the 31st? Alright. Crap. I'm surprised I remembered that. I surely would have forgot. Alright, so Akihiko said he is in front of Uwata Dai Station. Hmm. Let's see what he's on about. Uh, let me just go over here real quick. Sky. Uh. Yo, did you see my text message? Want to go grab a bite? This would be a good opportunity to know him better. Yep. Should definitely spend the evening. Let's go. Great, let's go. I've gotten a lot of my edge back since I've been able to focus on my training. Mm -hmm. I've been meaning to thank you for that. You've really stepped up as our leader. So tonight's on me. You've got enough responsibility as it is. Oh, well, that's nice of you. I I can handle it. <laughs> you really are something else. Mm -hmm. I knew I had a good feeling about you. Yep. Just don't push yourself too hard. Things will get easier with experience. And if you need anything, let me know. I'll do whatever I can to help. Uh, excuse me. Hmm? Uh, I heard you lived in Iwatodai, but wow, I never thought I'd run into you here. Oh, uh. We're big fans of yours. Please, can I get a picture with you? He's got so many fans. I'm busy, and I don't like having my picture taken. I kept hearing rumors that you were injured. Uh, are you okay now? Do you need any help? I is there anything I can bring you? Uh. Sure. Celebrity, maybe? Wanna go see? Celebrity? <laughs> Let's go. Wait, 
Ah, oh, man. I've had this problem at school, but I didn't think it happened out here too. <laughs> it's probably because of those interviews or the rumors online. I've gotten all kinds of attention as I've kept up my winning streak. Hmm. Um, I mean, sounds rough, I guess. <laughs> you could say that again. I'm not some panda in a zoo for everyone to gawk at. All I want is to be as strong as I can. I want to train hard and feel real pride in my strength. But all I ever seem to get is more trouble. All right, looks like they've given up. Let's head out to eat. For real this time. We only have so many hours left in the day. Yeah, come on. Hey, don't be like that. I know a place that'd be perfect for us, girl. Oh, no. <sighs> this is not good for him. Please, just leave us alone. We're not interested. Hey, what's up, Elijah? Good to see you. I hope you're doing well. How's it going? One drink. That's all we're asking. Come on. It'll be fun. It's going great. You got affiliate? Congrats. Good stuff. Very, very good. Hmm. It's those girls from earlier. Are they being hit on? Hmm. How's my attacking going? It's going good. Um, I should be able to get to Tekken King. I might not get to it like this weekend because I have, I'm going to be you know, just kind of chilling this weekend, but we'll see. If I do have time to do it, then it will be this weekend. Otherwise, it'll probably be the next time that I stream it. Also, thank you. I appreciate that. Hmm. Hey. Mm. Leave them alone. You don't want the police to get involved, do you? Mm. Huh? Who the hell are you? What? You want to call the cops? Quit trying to act like a big man, you little punk. Uh-oh. -uh. Yeah, time for you to piss off. You piece of... Oh, no. He's not the one. Hold up. You've got some slick moves. I bet you know how to fight, all right? So what if I do? How about you and I go a few rounds? If you ain't too busy, there's a spot around back. Oh, man. Whenever I see guys who think they're hot shit, all I want to do is put them in their place. These guys don't know. You a tough guy. So how about we put it to the test? Oh, boy. <sighs> what? Is he scared now? <laughs> see? I told you, nothing but trouble. Stay here. I'll be done in a minute. What? You think you're gonna beat me just like that? But don't worry. I won't go all out against an amateur. It's gotta be a fair fight. Nah. <laughs> hey, over there! Oh. It up. Oh, it's the police. Let's beat it. It's five zero. I told you, officer. They were the ones antagonizing us. And I told you we'll hear all about it down at the station. Oh, no. No! Students, aren't you? We'll need your contact information to notify your parents about it. No, no, no! This is not the way it was supposed to go. Like, we, and then the girls left, so we don't have anybody to speak on our behalf. This is awful. It's just going all wrong we got uno reversed if i could butt in oh it's kurosawa our savior kurosawa -san. i'll handle these two i've already cleared it with the brass oh thank goodness 
I don't know what's going on here, but you better not be starting any trouble. It wasn't our fault. Then why'd we get a report from two ladies saying you were attacked by a group of punks? Oh, so they went to the police. The ladies went to the police and that's why. So why were they antagonizing us? If they got the report from the ladies that we were being attacked. That doesn't make any sense. I don't understand. Huh. Hello, what's up, Lenore? Good to see you. They wanted to test my strength. I was just giving them what they wanted. Nah, there we go. Akihiko is a real one. In the middle of a public street. You really need to think things through. He wanted to go around back, to be fair. So it would have worked out beautifully. We weren't going to be in the middle of the street. We were just, you know, talking trash. Listen, I'm an officer of the law. I don't care who you are. Anyone who disturbs the peace is going to have to deal with me. <sighs> As you can see, your friend here is a bit of a hothead. I mean... See, this is why, like, I fucks with Akihiko. He does not care. He's like, if something's wrong... I'm going to go in and if you want to like, you know, prove that your might is being used for something bad, then I'm in there. I know it won't be easy, but try and keep an eye on him, would you? <laughs> you want me to keep an eye on him? No, oh, boy. Um, leave it to me, I guess. This is Those are some bold words. But thanks. Get Kurosawa off your back. My arms healed, then we've got way more dependable people now. There's no better time to test my strength. Oh, he down the scrap too. Like I feel you. I feel you. Especially in those situations. But we gotta listen to 50 right now. Especially now that we have someone like you. We really lucked out on that one. So I'm gonna keep honing my skills. That way. I can put down anyone I face with my own two hands. <laughs> you really haven't changed at all. <laughs> in any case, don't get in over your heads. I have a hunch the guys you ran into were from a gang that's been active around here recently. Oh, active gang? Mm. Just be careful. You don't want to get on their bad side. Because once you're on it, you'll never get off. Ah. It's late. You better head on home. So much for eating out. <laughs> it's been non-stop interruptions all night. Yeah, let's just grab like two beef bowls and head back to the dorm. <sighs> Kurosawa son's right though. We should probably head home. Sorry about this. I'll treat you some other time. Fair enough. I'm gonna do some jogging on the way back. You wanna join? Sure. If that's what you want to do. It's dark, so watch out for cars. I'm gonna run ahead. You just follow at your own pace. Uh, oh, okay. I ran back to the door. <laughs> I feel like my stamina has improved. Ooh, that's good. Oh, yay! My HP increased by five. Nice. All right, next. I can hear people talking. Um, hey. hey, have you heard about the second year? Yep, yep. Oh yeah, the one they found lying in front of the school gate this morning, right? Hopefully she just ran away from home. But I feel like this is the start of something big. You know hmm? Yeah, there might be reporters and camera crews and stuff. I'd rather not deal with that. Oh boy. The first bell rang. What is going on? Hmm? Hey, did you hear about that girl in 
the two E? Yeah, I heard they have no idea what happened. Oh my god, isn't it so bizarre? Oh boy. Man, everyone's talking about it. People sure got a lot of time on their hands. So, you hear about it too? Mmm, I haven't. A girl from 2E went missing while she was out late last night. And this morning, they found her lying in front of the school gate. Hmm. Nobody knows what happened. And supposedly, she's still unconscious. Huh. Morning. Yo, you can talk. Man, this is a tough case. Even for Junpei Yori, Ace Detective. <laughs> Ace Detective? Ace Detective. Um. <laughs> More like stupid Ace Defective. Oh no. Where'd that come from? Actually, now that I think about it, I haven't seen you all morning. Where you been? <laughs> I was talking to the teacher. Mm -hmm. That girl they found. I saw her yesterday on my way back from practice. She seemed just fine then. Hmm. Huh. The plot thickens. Thick plot. After school. Class has ended. All right. So what are we doing? I pity the fool who don't know when to quit. Mr. J says to throw in the towel, boy. <laughs> uh. Yeah. Real talk, though, I'm a little worried about how more and more people are becoming victims. Yeah, I don't know what he was talking about, but I'm just going to agree. <laughs> uh... Ah, this is a sale day. Michael, old man across. I'll be in the hallway. Rumors suck, man. That one about the girl who collapsed is already all over the school. I hope no one spreads any rumors about me. Hmm. Oh. Oh. You know those rumors? They are a little creepy. Yeah, they are. All right. I need to head to the pharmacy. Do some uh, shopping. Hmm? Reporter, she's here again. Another victim of those mysterious incidents was found at Gekukan High. Since the victim was at the front gate, that must be the scene of the crime. If the victim was attacked somewhere else, they'd have to be carried to the front gate. But why would the culprit do such a thing? The reasoning doesn't add up. Anyway, there's a high probability that Gekukan itself is involved in all this somehow. Oh boy. That woman's good. She doesn't know what she's on to, but she's on to something. All right, there's a sale. Bum, bum. Ba -da -ba -da -ba. All right, so I should get some of this. And I should get some medicinal. I got everything I need. Thank you. Hmm. All right. So let's see here. Next. Hmm. Who do I want to hang with? Who do I want to hang with? Maybe I should check my phone. Um... Our bond won't get any stronger. I might go hang with Michael. I think that's what I'll do. Hmm. 
Let me duplicate something at the shrine and then I'll be right with her. Yep, yep. Do you want to hang out with us today? All right. Let's hang out. Yay. Okay, then let's all play together. calling him stripey i mean i get it but oh he don't look too well you don't look so good are you sick yes i'm surprised you could tell it ain't hard to tell <laughs> not to be rude huh? you really are sick hmm I don't think he's kidding. I think he's putting it on the front for her, you know. But hey, we'll go with it. No fair, I trusted you. Don't tease me just because I'm a kid. Mm. Oh boy. And who are you? Uh I'm Michael's friend. Oh. <laughs> Do you see yourself as her guardian? Or are you simply two children playing together? Uh. Hey, I'm hungry now. I want takoyaki. Takoyaki! <laughs> you can eat with us too, Stripey. No, I'll pass. Thanks. Hmm. See you later. And just like that. And slow fashion, there he goes. Yes, he is. I usually see him around the shrine on Sundays. Sundays? Okay. I pass by on the way to cram school. Mm hmm. Okay, it's takoyaki time. All right, let's go get some takoyaki. It's so hot, I almost burned myself. Mm hmm. in his mouth at once. That hasn't been coming home much these days. Oh. Uh. It's my birthday soon. Do you think you'll come home and see me? Don't worry, he'll be there. <gasps> you really think so? Mm-hmm. Oh. You really love me? You wouldn't get a divorce. That might be why she's not asking, but you know, hopefully she'll just know what to get her. You're the only one who spends time with me. Oh. Poor thing. Oh, I have to go home. Today's laundry day. Mm. She's going to do our laundry? See you later, okay? This young, huh? Hmm. Poor thing. Oh, welcome back. Thank you. Did you hear the rumor going around school? I mean, come on, a ghost story? You think they'd be old enough to know ghosts aren't real? Anyway, uh, I'm feeling kind of uneasy all of a sudden, so I think I'll go to bed early. Sorry. 
So I won't be going to Tartarus today then. Sorry. No problem. Hmm, the seems Takabakun has a sixth sense when it comes to shadows. Actually, that's quite common. Dealing with shadows has a tendency to enhance other senses. That's interesting. Apparently, Tartarus is off limits today. Mitsuru's in training, and Takaba has a bad feeling right now. Sheesh. Could she be any more mysterious about it? Alright. Well, um... What else can I do? Can I make money? No? No money to be made? Uh... She's upstairs. Yukatan's freaking out for no reason. All I said to her was that someone might be in her room or under her bed or in her closet. What? I mean, come on, that's nothing to get all worked up about, right? I'm gonna throw him in the trash. Wait, seriously? All she'll probably see is one of those big ass cockroaches. Well, I guess that would be pretty scary too. Yes, Junpei, that's scary too. Oh my God, Stupid, shut up. Now I'm never gonna get to sleep tonight. Well, guess I should take responsibility and come by your room tonight to check on you and... What? And what exactly? Do I need to call the police? Or better yet, Kirijo senpai what? Wait, wait. I was gonna say and sing you a lullaby. It was just a joke. Oh, boy. Okay. Hmm. I'll go to the rooftop soon. Check on her. I'm sorry, but I'm in the middle of training my persona to search for enemies. The others appear to be busy as well. If you were planning on going to Tartarus, perhaps it would be better to go another night instead. Yeah, I'm, I'm not planning on that. I just wanted to talk, but alright. How are these doing? Hmm. Let me head to the strip mall. Maybe I'll get like a prodigy platter or something. Make sure there's nothing else I can buy. Oh, is it busy? What? Big burger, big eater challenge? Oh boy. Food challenge at night. Alright, I will try it. Elizabeth wants me to do it, so... Let's get it done. All right, let's try it. Oh my gosh, this is a ridiculous amount of burgers. I wonder if I'll be able to finish everything. No matter how much I eat, the amount of burgers just doesn't seem to decrease. Um. Do I focus on a single burger or do I look away from the burgers? Because glancing at the pile of burgers isn't going to help. Uh, let's focus on a single burger. Let's focus. Instead of flavor, each bite only brings only more pear pain. I don't think I can finish everything. Ah. 
I couldn't eat it all. I'll have to try again some other time. We tried. That's unfortunate. Although I couldn't finish it, I feel like I've grown just by taking the challenge. Okay. Oh, it is Sunday, isn't it? Hmm? Text message? Huh? Guess who's bored? No school and no track practice. Guess that means we gotta go somewhere fun. Let's hang out. Might be a good opportunity to strengthen the bond. Ah, I wanted to go chill with the guy in stripes, but if this could strengthen the bond, then that would be good too. Maya wants to hang out. All right. Um, I don't think there's any... I can go downstairs real quick, chat with people. If you wanna go ahead, you need to hmm. The girl they found was one of those girls I overheard talking about bullying someone. It's probably unrelated though, right? Hmm, they could be connected. That's... Maybe. Honestly, something about it is bothering me too. Hmm. If you're looking for Mitsuru, she's in the back of the reception area. Apparently, she's uploading the dorm's records or something to the school server. She's got to do it every so often. I know it's her job, but still, she's really got a lot on her plate. Hey. Honestly. This incident is quite troubling. As the student council president, I need to do something. Though it doesn't help that I have no idea what's really going on. Yeah. Uh, alright. So, she wants to hang out. I think I will hang with her real quick. So let's hang. Whew, it was pretty crowded in there, huh? I wanted to give the punching machine a try, but the line's gotten so long I'd rather not. Let's come back when it's less packed. Oh my gosh. Look, it's so cute. Plus, we might be able to get it in one shot. It's been a while since the last time I played. I may not look it, but I'm pretty good at these. <laughs> Hopefully she's pretty good. Ah, huh? I couldn't grab it at all. What? No way. That's such bull. This has to be rigged or something. <laughs> Why is menu suck an option? <laughs> <laughs> uh let's just calm down first yeah. oh yeah right if grabbing it doesn't work i'll just have to slowly shift its position until it drops it's kind of a pain but slow and steady wins the race same thing with sports right People who are dedicated to train become world-class athletes. Oh, kind of went on a tangent there. Anyway, let's give this another shot. All right, she seems motivated. She's motivated. Let's go. Feel like we became a lot closer. What's she trying to get though? Well, at least I got it in the end, but I'm so tired now. I definitely run out of stamina and money. Let's head back. I need to eat dinner and recuperate. All right. I headed back to the door. I see you're back. Oh, you're back. Yep, I am back. Seriously? Damn, rumors spread fast, especially this one. Everyone at school knows about it, and soon everyone in town will too. That's not good. No messages. Hmm. 
I probably need to head to the mall. So let's go. Head to the mall and uh Oh wait, 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 wait. Let's not head to the mall yet. Hold up. I think I'm able to like put my food in the fridge. Yep, chill it. All right, now we're good. Now we've done the thing. Bum, 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 bum. Hmm. What was I going to Polonia for? Hmm. Oh. I know what I'm going for. Good day. I have to actually like prevail in it. Crap. All right, let's see. Hey. 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 To do is to be. Well, maybe there's a game I can play or something. Strength? I don't know. Twenty second. What's this? Mayodo, July eighteenth. Okay, so some stores are still in the process of reopening. Okay, let me think here. Let me try this food challenge again. This is gonna suck, but. We're gonna try something different. Eating while staring off in the distance made me feel a little better. Feel like I'm making progress, but I shouldn't get ahead of myself. Hmm, should I wash it down with soda or eat it without stopping? Soda. No, my stomach hurts. No. The soda was a bad idea. It's supposed to help. Oh no. Huh? We're switching to the summer uniform today. 
It's almost time to leave. Good morning. Mm, good morning. The student body seems to be rather restless lately. Don't you agree? Mm, yeah. I thought so. Well, I only hope it doesn't have anything to do with the shadows. Akihiko said we may be receiving a new member, but we still don't know when we'll be attacked. So remain alert at all times. Okay. You got it, boss woman. Class has ended. All right, let's see what's going on. What's going on? Who's where? Ghosts can be creepy, but they don't have to be, right? If there was a ghost that looked like a cute girl, I wouldn't mind being haunted by it. Well, as long as she doesn't devour my soul or something. How quaint. Huh, Micah? Uh-oh, how are you? I'm doing okay. Oh, no. We have a new burger? Oh, boy. Uh... All right. I wonder what's wrong with Micah. I need to check to see who I would grow closer to. For real, for real. But there's... A sale. Although I don't think I need anything, but... Did you hear that, uh, what was it? See, apathy syndrome? There was a victim at Gekukan High. She was friends with my son, Senpai. A victim in your own neighborhood? Oh my, I guess we can't say it's none of our business now. My son's teacher, relative son calligraphy teacher, caught apathy syndrome too. It's not funny, but man, the links. I don't think he has anything new. The number of people affected with apathy syndrome seems to be increasing. I thought it would decrease, but I guess that was just wishful thinking. We could be in for the long haul, so feel free to get prepped here. Yeah, as the uh, the number goes up, that's not good. Running a little sale today. See if anything What are you looking for? Yeah. I don't really need anything. I wish I could see what they already have on them. That what you want? Having second thoughts? Cause I don't know if that's what I want to grab. All done here. Be seeing you. But. Mm. Hmm. Who do I want to hang with? I should check who. Yeah, not Miyamoto. I could go to student council. Um, Maiko is an option. So, student council or Maiko? <sighs> it's Monday. It's Monday. I think Michael's here tomorrow as well. But I don't think student council is. Crap. I need like a friggin' calendar. I guess I'll go to, uh, I'll go to Maiko. She doesn't seem to be doing very well. Do you think Stripey is okay? He said he's only here on Sundays, but I can't come that day. I wish we could play again, but I'll be okay since 
you're here today. All right, let's spend some time. Mm-hmm. Well, guess what? Mom and Dad both remembered! Yay! They really do care about me. Of course they do. That's great news. Yeah! They were smiling and happy and everything! Hmm. Nice. <laughs> it's been so long since we ate together as a family. We used to do it all the time. That's okay. How come mom and dad don't get along anymore? Ah, uh, adult things, but you don't want to hear that. I'll just ask them why. Oh boy. Uh, that might not be a good idea. If I know why, I can fix it and make it all better. Hmm. I don't think this is gonna go very well at all. I'm gonna make mom and dad happy again. Oh boy. What she probably doesn't realize is she's probably the only aspect of their relationship that makes her happy. Makes either one of them happy right now. Since they're going through a divorce, it's sad. Oh, you poor thing. Okay. I'm gonna ask them. Hmm. Bye bye. Let's play again later, okay? Good luck, dear. Even though I don't think it's a good idea. Let's head back to the door. That poor thing. Time. You ever check out the student message boards and stuff? You know how last week that girl was found by the front gate? Yeah. Well, now they're saying it was an angry spirit from this one ghost story that did it. Great. Come on. Nobody really believes that stuff. Right? They shouldn't. But they probably do. This ghost story about. What? Hmm? Made up. We don't need to go into details, do we? What's it about? I'm interested. Go on, tell us. Hmm. Mm -hmm. You got it. Here goes. Oh no. Good evening, and welcome to Junpei's. Believe it, Wadum. There are many strange things in this world. Legend has it, late at night, after everyone has gone home, a maniacal ghost roams the halls and devours anything caught in its grasp. <laughs> the other day, this friend of mine, let's call him Witness A. Anyway, <laughs> he said to me, Hey, Iori. I saw something weird the other day. He sounded so serious. <laughs> so I asked him what he'd seen. He told me he saw the girl <laughs> from 2E. <gasps> he watched her go into the school on the night before the incident. <laughs> I told him I didn't believe it. Not even for a second. That girl from 2E ain't the type to go wandering around at night. But Witness A was as white as a sheet. <laughs> he swore to me it was true. Then it hit me. If the girl was found unconscious at school, then maybe the ghost really did make her its dinner. It all made sense. She went to the school at night. And walked right into its deadly trap. Oh my gosh. The chill run down my spine. And I broke into a cold sweat. <laughs> yes. 
There truly are some strange things in this world. Truly. Or don't. Uh. What do you think, Akihiko? <laughs> Seriously? Not one word about my amazing performance just now? Nope. I'm not so interested in the ghost part, but it does sound like it's worth investigating. Oh, you're afraid of ghosts, huh, Yukata? Didn't know you were such a chicken. Oh, no. What? Who are you calling a chicken? Fine, then. Let's investigate it. Each of us will ask around for the rest of the week and gather information. Oh, no. The story's just a bunch of nonsense. I'll show you. Sounds good to me. The story uh. is a bit unnerving, isn't it? Huh? We'll leave it to you guys, then. Would have been too scary for me. What? No. Okay. Well. Come to think of it, the taiyaki I put in the fridge should be chilled by now. Maybe I should go get it. I think I will get it. Give me my taiyaki. But a note was left in the spot. What? Junpei ate my Tayagi. Oh, I'm going to throw him in the trash. Oh, no. I don't believe this. He ate it? So I'm not going to get to savor the taste. Oh my gosh. Just throw the whole Junpei away. All right, what's going on? Hey, Sorry. I'm trying to find stuff online about that ghost story. It seems like it could take a while though. So I'm not going to go to Tartarus today. Sorry, that's okay. I'm not going today either. I'll probably go make money. If Takaba won't go to Tartarus tonight, perhaps it would be better to go when everyone can join us. Though I have to admit I'm a bit curious about these supposed hauntings. Hmm, this isn't good. We're getting a lot of inquiries from parents and reporters alike. Oh, that's not good at all. Your car seems pretty serious. Well, it's good to be that invested in things. If you're free, how about lending her a hand? I mean, that's cool, but she's on the computer. I mean, I guess I could go to my computer. Is that what you mean? I don't really like want to look up stuff on my personal computer though. All right, what's coming up? See, this doesn't show. Like, instead of showing the jobs, can you show, like... Hmm. Wait, this is a full moon. On the 8th, right? Hmm. Uh, I can go make some money. I think that's the way to go. Making money is the way to go. Let me show you. All right, let's think about this. Oh, uh, actually, there we go. Money. Sweated it out while working part time. A customer called me over and praised my service. Very nice. 
A drunken businessman tried to pick a fight with me, but I did my best to deal with him. Hmm. Here's your paycheck for today. Try to use it wisely. Let's go. Courage and charm up. <laughs> Yay. Huh? Uh-oh. -uh. Good evening. Good evening. Creepy child. Come back just as I promised. I'll mm -hmm. be there. Uh, I'm, I'm, I want to say get out of here, but I'm just going to be like, it's you. Cause I don't think you leaving if you got it so easily. I'm glad you remember me. Oh boy. In another week, the moon will be full again. The next ordeal will be upon you. Be careful. All right. Until next time. All right. Yeah. Next full moon is next week. He's saying be careful. So we got to make sure we're ready. Morning. Good morning. I'm just going to do my best from today onwards. Uh, with what? The ghost story, duh. Did you already forget what we talked about last night? I mean, I was just trying to be nice. Damn. Well, whatever. I'm going to look into everything there is about it. Remember, we share our findings on Friday. Could you also try gathering information too? Like maybe you could talk to some students after school. Okay. Y'all aren't going to let me not do it, so... Ah, this phrase. Mono Susamajiku also appears in Ugetsu Monogatari. Of all the Ugetsu tales, I'm most fond of the one about the vengeful ghost wife. Ha! Huh. He's talking ghosts too? Lovely. Such an eerie yet poignant story. Speaking of which, I've got a pretty good ghost story of my own. Care to hear it? Uh, feeling sleepy. Should I close my eyes? No, I need the smarts. Yes, precisely. Then, my friend, the one who came with me into the tunnel suddenly screamed. There's a girl right behind you. We ran back home, scared out of our wits but not long after that i started hearing the strangest thumping noises coming from inside the wall and the faintest voice croaking let me out let me out as far as i knew that room had always been vacant who was in my wall so one night i decided to go right up to the wall where the sound came from and knock on it <laughs> all of a sudden Right in my ear, I hear this girl's voice loud and clear. I'm here. And that's where the youngest member of my family came from. She grew up to be just like any ordinary human, though. What? <laughs> Nowadays, I only lie awake in fear that she'll run off and marry this loser she's been seeing. <laughs> Oops, there's the bell. Okay, class, that's all for today. I forced myself to stay awake. <laughs> Did I actually get smarter off that? Okay. I did. I was like, did did my intelligence go up off that or? Ah. Uh, did you find out anything about the ghost story? I'm gonna prove to everyone that it was just a rumor, and I'm not scared. All right. Who she is on edge. <sighs> All right, I need to like, 
I have to ask questions and it's like, uh, do I have to? But I, I guess I have to, right? I kind of don't want to, but I guess I have to. So that's what we're gonna do. Did you hear? I haven't. Kirito Senpai would want a man who likes to study. Maybe I should study more. If I became the smartest in my class, she might accept me even though I'm a girl. Oh boy, all right. Huh? Who's this? Uh, about what happened the other day, I um sort of overreacted and I um just wanted to say I'm sorry. I get really nervous when I talk to people, although I know I shouldn't, I should really do something about it. It is it especially bad when I talk to boys. All I can think about is running away at that situation. Um, I mean, I don't want her to run away. I'm a guy. I, I know, that's why I'm so nervous now. So, sorry, I know I can't perform my duties on the student council if I'm like this. I have to try harder to overcome this phobia. Uh, okay. I heard Yamagishi-san fainted again, and she's taking days off from school. I wonder if she's okay. She doesn't look very strong. Oh boy. They said a girl in class 2C fainted too. And I heard his apathy syndrome again. I wonder if it's contagious. I already told you, she just happened to faint in front of the gate. Apathy syndrome is so over-exaggerated. They'll get better if you give them some time. That, uh, oh boy. All right, hmm. Uh. We have to go and do some more digging, don't we? Let's go to the main lobby. My sister goes here too. It's a good thing she's not the kind of girl who stays out all night. Yeah, good thing. Carry on. Hmm, there's no one to talk to down there. I never expected anything like this to happen to someone from this school. Yeah, I know. Uh. Oh. Hey, I'm still in the middle of my investigation. Let me know if you find anything. Okay. Welcome. Welcome. Come again. Okay. Welcome. Can we just talk? Oh dear. Did you hear that one of the students fainted? Is she all right? Hmm, there's a lot of weird stuff going on out there. You should watch out too. I should, shouldn't I? I don't think there's anything down this way. That's the lab hallway. This is faculty hallway. Let's go to the corridor, see if we can find anything. Did you see that? He just threw a rock at a bird resting on that branch. If he keeps that up, he might get possessed by evil spirits. But that's just a rumor, so probably not. <laughs> Great, okay. Everyone's beginning to believe. Let's try the school gates, see if um, anyone's talking. I'm waiting for my boyfriend. I'm scared about all the stuff that's been happening lately, so he's gonna walk me home. Ooh, there's a thingy here, ooh. Yay. Hey, I read those ghost stories that were being spread around school on the internet. You know, the ones about those students who died became ghosts and ate humans. Wait, how would anybody know they ate humans? There wouldn't be any remains. Oh boy. Asking the important questions. All right. I guess I need to ask around town. So let's go to the station. Uh. Oh boy, she's on the ground. 
You know these incidents where people get apathy syndrome, right? Those guys look so weird. They're all over town. If it was a sci-fi movie, it'd be aliens doing it. If it was a thriller, it'd be some secret organization. But it's real life, so I have no idea what's happening. Hmm. Oh, the guy's not here. Crap. All right. Pump, 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 pump. Hmm. They're not chatty today. All right. Let me see here. Let's try to strip mall in the station. Nothing? Hmm. to talk to around here oh the strip mall gosh look at all those apathy syndrome guys they're skipping school and work right that's nice i wish i had apathy syndrome too then i could sit here all day long just like them that's not good Kid with the cat is in here. Hmm. Uh, hey, this man. He must really not like working. You know, Lenore? It's kind of crazy. Let's go to the mall. There are more of those people every day. They're so creepy. Maybe I should go on home. Hmm. I mean, I don't feel like I have any new information. Ah. I tried. Who wants to hang out today? Alright, so... Let's hang out with Kenji real quick. Oh, no. Our bond won't get any stronger right now. It's kind of weird. Like, is it or is it not? So let's make, meet with Bebe. Hello. Let us be off to the home economics room. Yep. Let's go to fashion club. Yes. Sewing is such fun, and I shall sew to my heart's content. Sew it, knit it, and finally weave it together. We're the only two members. Today our work is done. To the tea shop, Azuki Arai, together? Sure. Oh, my first time going. Will you maybe, uh, how do you say, show me the ropes? Um, sure, let's go. Oh, you are my hero, Kataja Kanai. Dakora, let's be off then. We'll go together, my Tomodachi. <laughs> Dear 
Suzuki desserts here are amazing. Red bean is so oishi. <laughs> I love the culture of Nihon. Japan is sukoi. Amazing. What about your country? My home has delicious food too. Uh oh. But, uh, Japanese sweets are so good. I am in love. Daisuke. Japanese culture is number one. Ichiban. Oh, I am so happy I came here. Well, we're happy to have you here too. I want to learn everything about Nihon and become Japanese. Ah. Thank you for joining me today. I won't forget your kindness. I have an aunt who lives back home. She has been helping me. Hmm. I have to tell her that I've made a wonderful new tamodachi. <laughs> Yay, baby. Peace out. I parted ways with Bebe and went back to the door. Welcome back. What's up, dude? Hey, apathy syndrome has been on the rise or something, right? There are all those weird rumors going around school. So I feel antsy just doing nothing. Eh, I hope we get to do another operation where we throw down with a big shadow and wa-pow! Give it a good ass whooping, you know? <laughs> I bet he does. Ah. Wait. A lot of solo. Okay. That's I thought those stories were all fake, but she seems to be doing actual research on them. Is this the power of Dream Pace? Believe it or don't. What? What? You got a problem. Oh. Yikes. She's seriously pissed, man. Yeah, she's very on edge. All right. Could it be? It is difficult for me to believe that the incident was caused by ghosts. However, we are currently at a lack of a more logical explanation. So it may be worth looking into. Please let me know if you come across any useful information. Well, good luck. Whatever the reality is, this definitely sounds like it'll be interesting. I'm looking forward to the results. Uh, what did I get myself into? Actually, I didn't get myself into anything. This is all Junpei's fault. Stupid and this stupid, believe it or don't. Gah. <laughs> uh, when's the next? I forget when the next fridge, fridge clean out is. 16, my gosh, all right. All right, we're almost to that. <sighs> what to do? We could go to Tartarus, but I don't think there's a need for it. They're urgently seeking workers, so I could probably just go work. I think working is good. It's pretty crowded today. I have to work more efficiently than usual. The customers are ordering a lot today. The cafe is filled with pheromones. Carried off a lot of dishes. Thank you. Little bonus.
we take those. What's up, dude? Hey, are you looking into that ghost story? Like asking around about it? Of course. Really? Shouldn't we just let Yucatan handle it? I think she's talking this, taking this way too seriously, dude. Guess she can be pretty stubborn. I've got better things to do. Besides, I have plenty of scary stories up my sleeve. I bet the story I told the other night made your hair stand on end. They say it's true though. Sure. Sure. Class has ended for today. What's going on, Michael? I want to see you. Oh, she put a little heart by it. Okay. Huh? Well, I guess we should do some digging. I wonder what people will say. It's a ghost story after all. It is a ghost story after all. How much more digging do I have to do? Like no one's saying anything. Mm, I guess we'll do more digging. One of the students who collapsed was in my sister's class. I guess she was running away from home as well. I heard she always hung around those thugs at that one place. Something must have happened there. Thugs at one place? Okay. I know where that is. That girl who collapsed is in my class. I heard she would run away from home and stay out all night. Maybe she got caught up in something bad. That is excellent information. Just kind of what I needed, actually. Because now I can go investigate. I know where that is. Let me just check the corridor. Okay, nothing here. Um, and then that's the gym hallway. Check the school gates. Nothing at the school gates. All right, head to the town map. That would be Port Island Station. The outskirts probably. Does something happen back here? Hmm, I don't see any signs. Hello, cat. Hmm, yeah, okay, fine. Let's head to the mall then. Let's see, to start the game, insert one coin, control it using the two buttons, and what are you looking at? I'm not just reading the directions, I'm carefully planning my moves. Okay, whatever. Good luck with that. Hmm. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Hmm. The strip mall, I guess. I mean, I've been asking around, so they can't be too mad at me, right? Right? Who wants to hang? I think I might hang with Yuko. Let me see who's about to. So, Maiko. Yuko. Of course, Bebe, probably. Okay, I'm gonna hang with Yuko. Easy choice, easy choice. <laughs> hey, you heading home? We were interrupted last time, so if you're down, want to try hanging out again? Yep. 
great. Let's hit the town and have some fun this time. How about we head to Polonia Mall? Maybe we can get some cake from Changal too. Oh yeah. Have you been training to strengthen your core? It's a good hmm? idea if you want to shorten your run time. You're less likely to injure yourself too. Ah. I'm talking with Kaz about putting it in the first year's practice routine actually. Hmm. Hmm? Do you mind if we continue talking in the cafe? I'm a little hungry. I don't mind. Let's go. Oh no. What in the world? You again. Why does he keep running into you? Oh man. You know it's dangerous to be running around a place like this. You're lucky it's just me. But what if you bumped into a scary man, huh? If you want to play, do it at your schoolyard. Hmm. We can't play there. The sixth graders are always hogging everything by playing soccer. Hmm. Said they'll move if we can beat them in a race, but we're only fourth graders. There's no way we could win. Aw. That's why we had to play tag here instead, Auntie Yuko. Oh, gosh. I'll let the auntie slide this time. It's only because I feel sorry for you. All right. Come with me. Hmm? This field is so big. Hmm? <laughs> they said it's fine for us to use the schoolyard for a bit. Oh, that's nice. Normally, you wouldn't be allowed in here. Understand? So don't touch anything you're not supposed to. And if something happens, let us know immediately. Mm-hmm. Can you promise that? We promise. Good. Then practice until the big hand on that clock reaches 12. And don't go inside the school building. <laughs> All right, let's do this. Wait, come here for a second. Mm hmm. Gonna give him running tips, probably. You your arms more. Ah, yeah. And don't lift your legs so high, or you might pull a muscle. Come on, give it a try. You just gotta believe in yourself. <laughs> That's so funny. But I've never tried coaching before. What? What do you think I should do? I think you'd be great at it. Why not give it a go? Really think I should? Yeah. Ryan, please. Please. Hmm. Well, it isn't a decision to make lightly. All right. I'll be your coach. Yay. Go easy on you guys, and no one's allowed to quit halfway either. Got it? <laughs> Got it, Coach Hugo. Hey, is he gonna teach us too? Is he your boyfriend, Coach? Uh, <laughs> never you mind about that. Now, everyone, line up. I <laughs> go easy on you, didn't I? All right, she began instructing each child passionately. They'll try their best. I watched Yuko as she coached the kids. Eventually, they all went home. Once they started calling me coach, I couldn't resist. <laughs> hey, um, hmm? I was wondering, would you maybe want to do this coaching thing together? I know I'm asking a lot, but uh, I don't know much about racing. And plus, you're really athletic, too. Um. So if you'd coach them with me, I'd really appreciate it. I mean, I'm not really a coach, but... I mean, why not, right? <laughs> Please? Honestly, I don't think I can handle it on my own. Oh. Alright, sure thing. Oh, thank goodness. <laughs> I'm sure those kids will be happy, too. Thanks. You're welcome. 
Our relationship has grown. I know that I keep asking you for favors, but I'll make it up to you one day. <laughs> well, I left school with Yuko and returned to the dorm. All right, so what's going on? Yeah. The level of gossip at school is getting pretty out of hand. Today, there were three girls going on and on about a certain rumor. I really hope this gets taken care of sooner rather than later. Hey, hey did you do any research on that ghost story, akachi -kun? I sure did. Really? I knew I could count on you, but man, there sure are a bunch of different stories floating around. I can't tell which are real and which are fake. Maybe they're all fake. Dude, there are rumors all over school. Don't people have anything better to talk about? Now, how are we supposed to figure out what's true or not? It's hopeless. Oh, this won't be. It, it was it today? All right, no, it's the 16th. That's so far away. Well, I have mail. Part time, some games. All right. All right. And this is the third, which is Wednesday. We got the fourth. And then the fifth. Um, I could go to a wild duck. See if I could do the challenge. Bum, bum, bum. Or I could make money. Making money sounds good too. Making money sounds real good. Hmm. What do I want to do? make some money that's the more efficient thing to do all right that's what did it out as a waiter cleaned up efficiently and received compliments from other staff members I dealt with the housewives complaining once again that the coffee has no effect. Thank you for my paycheck. Hey. Yay. All right, let's head back to the dorm. Morning. Morning. This sucks. I spent so much time thinking about ghost stories and now I'm having nightmares. Don't push yourself. Don't worry, I'm fine. There are just so many stupid rumors going around that it's tough trying to make sense of this whole thing. I did get some useful info though, so I plan on digging even deeper today. Try to remember what you find out at school, okay? Okay. All right, what we got? Track practice. Uh. 
Oh yeah, totally random, but have you ever heard of the Gourmet King? Apparently there's a foodie around here who's a cut above the rest. Let's say he's a student at our school. Wouldn't it be cool if you told us the best places to eat? I'd totally take a date oh, yeah. there. I heard he's really into sandwiches now, so you could probably catch him eating one in town. The Gourmet King. Anyways, I'm gonna head out soon. How about you? Oh, you got something planned? All right, later. Yeah, I don't, it keeps saying like it won't get any closer and then it keeps saying it'll get closer and I'm just confused. I might have asked everyone what I could. So it's Thursday. Was that the mall? Oh, I think that's some. Nom nom nom. Hmm? W what? Don't look at me while I'm eating. You're making me feel self-conscious. I can't savor the flavor of my gourmet sandwich, only available for a limited time with you here. Oh boy, he's one of those. Likes to kind of gloat about like how Impressive something that he has is, or what he's doing is, or blah. I have enough charm to catch his attention. What are you eating? Oh, you're curious? Do you fancy yourself for gourmet? Is that even possible? An unrefined guy like you? I think not. You have to prove it. If you can pass my gourmet quiz, then I'll believe you. Hmm. What should I ask? I don't want to make it too difficult. Give me some time to think. Nom nom. Cool. Woo, what a sandwich. Now the quiz begins. This first question is a freebie. What's the most popular drink at the cafe over there? I mean, it's pheromone coffee. I work there. Correct. Here's question number two. What color skirt does Azuki Arise mascot, Azuki Chan wear? What? What? I need to prep. Azuki Arai? Is that, uh, at the strip mall? Azuki Arai? Oh boy. Red, red, red. All right. I'm just like, huh? Red? Hmm, you're pretty good. Question three, what item is on the secret menu at Hagakure? Uh, mm, there's a secret item? I need to prep. Like, I don't think there is a secret item on that. Like there's pork ramen and then there's like, I'm just gonna, I don't think there's a secret menu.
What a guy. All right. What a guy. <sighs> Do I feel like talking to this guy again? I just have to, like, this means I'm gonna have to waste one of my. Hmm. Very tempted. All right. Anyway. I guess I'll come back another day. He doesn't seem very nice anywhere, so we'll just come back another day. What's the... Who else wants to hang out? Dang it. Won't get any stronger. So what should I do? This is like the perfect day to interact with this guy. All right, look, we, we gonna get this right. Nope. I even really like the guy, so. Dumplings. What? Oh, no. All right. We're not doing that either. I don't think I would have, like, figured this out without doing a few other steps anyway, so. It's a bowl? I'm impressed. You seem to have some knowledge about food, but it pales in comparison to mine. Why don't you bring me something I've never eaten before? It'd have to be quite the odd morsel to fit that bill, though. If you succeed, then I'll accept you as a fellow gourmet. What? <laughs> he took my odd morsel? Okay, you can have that. Ugh, this is awful. But I'm impressed. I haven't tasted something like that in all my life. You're not so bad. Yeah, let's spend time with him. I wonder which one he is. I forgot which one he is. Um, I'm kind of embarrassed to ask you this right off the bat, but... Would you mind not standing so close to me? You're too thin and too cool. Oh. Oh boy. Uh if people start thinking we're best friends or something, I'm gonna end up as the uncool one. Oh wow. Yeah, I really don't like this guy. <laughs> there you are. I thought your voice sounded familiar. Uh you know what I'm here for. Now hand it over. Whoa! Not you! Huh? Help! Emergency! What? <laughs> What? Call the police? Yes, right. Good thinking. Quit making a scene, all right? People are looking at me funny. I've got some business to take care of now, but you, you're no Somi Suemitsu Kun, aren't you? I did my homework, see. What in the world did I get myself into? You know I'm not letting you off that easy, right? I suggest you reconsider things. What? My coin purse for a minute there. Oh boy. My name is Nozomi Suimitsu. Hi. By the way, may I just say that you have a wonderfully big heart for someone so slim? Uh, thanks? I've been acquainted with Nozomi Suimitsu, the gourmet king, apparently. Alright, what arcana is he? I see a lobster. 
He's moon. Ah, okay. Interesting. Whew, all that drama made me hungry. My stomach is definitely not amused. Oh boy. Tag along, friend? Shall I treat you to the finest dining? If so, you've come to the right place. I mean, if you're treating. For I am the king, the gourmet king. That's right. Gourmet King 2009. Or was it 2010? Oh boy. This guy's voice is kind of annoying too. I know all the kingliest places for Oh no. Emergency. He's about to become king of the restroom. Sorry, but I'll treat you uh, another time. Wait, I was right? Oh no. Ah, uh, oh. Uh. Yeah, it started going getting dark, so I went home. <laughs> oh, goodness. What's up, dude? Come to think of it, the crops are planted on the rooftop should be ready to harvest by now. Maybe I should go check on them. All right. Well done. Man, it's talk about something. Don't you get tired of these rumors? I sure do. Yeah, that's what I thought. Well, good luck with your research. Uh, where is everyone? Is Mitsuru not here? Oh, look at the tomatoes. Healthy tomato. Let's plant some uh, potato sprouts. Yeah, where's Mitsuru? Is she not here today or something? One, two, three. Wait, she's over on the side. There she is. All right. Hello. How's your research on the ghost story progressing? Um, great. Yes. It's a magnifique. Keep up the good work. No messages. Thursday. It's nothing to do. I guess I'll, uh, maybe I'll go to the strip mall. Try to eat something. Oh, it's too crowded and wild duck. Ah. Give me a break. Hmm, confident charm? Man, all right. Hmm, let me check to see if there's any academic games at the mall. and strength. Mm. <laughs> Let's uh, do some karaoke. I was shown to a spacious room where I could enjoy solo karaoke to the fullest. I sang many songs with all my heart. Courage has gone up, not caring what people think. Hey. Hmm. 
All right, it's Friday. Hey. Hey, do you remember what we're doing today? We're going to share our findings about the ghost stories tonight. Looking forward to it. Yeah. Yep, I heard some pretty interesting stories while asking around. Anyway, don't forget about it tonight, okay? I won't forget. Hmm? Oh, today's Friday. Did you two ask around like we agreed? Yes, yes, yes. Huh? Were we supposed to do something by today? Oh man, he just being a pain in the butt just to be a pain in the butt. I told you. I know, I know. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Uh, we have to do it after school. We can't do it tonight. Okay. Don't forget. Yeah, yeah. Yes, ma'am. Not gonna forget. I won't forget. All right, so uh oh there we go okay good day for sewing student council lots of people mm -mm -mm -mm. uh main lobby i guess Yeah, I don't see any speech bubble things. At all, really. Oh. My apologies. I need to make some time to study. There's a lot to cover, like the material on college entrance exams. Make sure you don't neglect your own studies as well. I know you have other things to worry about, but studying should be a student's number one priority. Wow, maybe if I was a genius, she'd spend some time with me. Oh boy. Okay. Well, I obviously am not a genius. At least not in this game. Uh, all right. Well. I should go to student council, I think. I think student council is fine. Let me just kind of make sure, though. Yeah, I'm like, whoa. What in the heck? Time for student council. I spent some time working with the student council. The hours flew by as I worked hard on my tasks. I don't see Odagiri. Is he absent today? Um, no. I'm pretty sure he came to school today. Hmm. Then where is he? Probably busy playing detective asshole. Nah. Ah, so this is what Fushimi was telling me about. I see. Well, his intentions are good, so you can't really blame him. But I understand how you feel. Oh, uh, you're all free to leave now. Good work today. No. Huh? Did you hear me? I want to see evidence, smart guy. What? I don't need evidence. I already know everything about you. Uh-uh. Like how you were arrested for beating up that guy in the park who snitched on you, right? What? Oh no. Well, he's still at it. This is the third time today. My boyfriend was so pissed after he was accused. This guy's really asking for it. Uh oh. 
Keeping quiet will only make things worse for you. Uh. If it's really not you, then give me some names. Um. And don't worry, I won't tell anyone. You have my word as a member of the disciplinary committee. Better fuck off, asshole. Oh boy. This guy looks like he's about to hit Odagiri. Uh, do I have to step in? I don't have to step in, but I probably should. Ah oh, man, knock it off. Oh, he definitely did hit him. Oh boy. Uh, I, I told him to knock it off. <laughs> I wasn't going to jump in the way. <laughs> oh boy. Oh no. And the guy on the phone in the back. Oh. Don't think I'll just let you get away with that. Dude. Oh. Hey. You got to calm down. What is it? Did you need something from me? And be a little more like more calm about it. Less abrasive. You went a little overboard. Mm hmm some people will lie and stab you in the back without hesitation if it benefits them people like that are a menace to society oh boy we tolerate that kind of behavior no we should do something about it <sighs> i know what people think of me then again those who fight for justice have always butted heads with others history speaks for itself uh-oh so let my actions serve as a warning to other offenders. A sensible person like you should understand, right? Uh, oh, man. I mean, we're starting to become better friends. Uh, he's really pissing people off, though. I'm going to keep at it for now. You should head home before it gets dark. Sheesh. I went back to the dorm. I parted ways with him. That's tough. Okay, as we agreed on Monday, we'll now hold a meeting to discuss what we've learned. Okay. Wow, you're really into this. Hmm. Yes, I am. I got lots of good info. Okay. And it turns out there was no angry ghost involved. Huh. So that's what's important, huh? First off, let's talk about how this rumor got started. Mm. The girl was found on the school grounds, so it does match the ghost story on that point. But why did the rumor spread so fast if this was the first time anything happened? I mean, there are three victims. Incident, the exact same thing happened to two other students. Mm -hmm. All three victims had to be hospitalized. No wonder people thought it was a ghost. Hmm. Okay, moving on. The victims were all in different classes, and at first glance, they don't seem to be connected. But they did have one thing in common. Anyone know what it was? What is this? A quiz show? <laughs> Do you know? I mean, they went to our school. Uh, why do I feel like that might not be it, though? So. Was it that they hung out a lot? Crap. They went to our school. Oh, hello. We already know that. <laughs> they hung out together, dummy. Oh my gosh, I will kick you in the head. Not just once or twice either. They all got in with a bad crowd and were always out late. Considering they all ended up the same way, it can't just be a coincidence. So to find out what happened, we're gonna do some field research. Great. What? 
field research. I shouldn't help you now. Yep. There's one place where all three victims were regulars. Whoa, hang on. You're not talking about that spot behind Port Island Station, are you? Why would we go there? Oh, you know about it? Uh. Dude, you can't go there. I've heard all kinds of nasty rumors about that place. Oh, really? Well, then all the more reason we should go together. You're coming with, right? I shouldn't. Just because you were mean to me? Sorry, count me out. Hey, come on. Don't worry. I'm sure Junpei's just exaggerating like he always does. Oh, man. I don't know about this. That place is seriously bad news. Do we really have to go there? Up until now, all we've done is follow orders. Isn't it about time we start thinking for ourselves? Oh, goodness. I know what you mean, but... Man, you have to say it like that. I guess I don't have a choice, do I? You don't have a choice. You can feel like that. I got a choice. Then it's settled. We'll go tomorrow night, so plan accordingly. Great. We've all agreed to go somewhere shady tomorrow night. Unfortunately. Jeez. See, I told you it wasn't a ghost story. There's no way they exist. Tomorrow night. Ah. I'm impressed that you've been able to gather so much information in such a short amount of time. What are you planning this time? Don't do anything too crazy. All right, enough is enough. Tomorrow, I'm going to put an end to Junpei's stupid believe it or don't. You're not too freaked out about all this, right? Yeah, I'm fine. Good. I knew I could count on you. I heard people gather there a couple times a month. The baddest of the bad all get together. It looks like a reunion for a bunch of ex-convicts. Hey, aren't we planning on going there tomorrow? Isn't that really bad? What if we run into them? Yeah, like, this is not a good idea. This is not a good idea at all. I'd rather not do that. But she, like, insists, so kind of sucks. Muscle boot camp. It seems to be educational software that teaches you about muscles. In this short session, you will learn 600 ways to use your muscles. An immense amount of information is being presented at a rapid pace. Congratulations, you are hereby promoted to muscle sergeant. I sure learned a lot about how to use my muscles. I feel like I have more stamina now that I've watched this. Lovely. All right. Gotten late. I should go back to my room. <sighs> I have to remember that I have plans tonight. Unfortunately. Class has ended. Check the phone. There's a pharmacy sale. You go. Hey, don't forget about today, okay? Uh huh. I should. You were mean to me. Anyway, uh, there's. A pharmacy sale. So we will go to the sale. There's a sale today. Mm, right. Let me see. Which I guess I'll buy a couple of those. Up 
few band aces. I think that's good. Come again, yeah? I think that's good. All right, so we got to do this after school. Who do I want to hang out with? All right, Bond won't grow. Bond won't grow. Uh, let's see what this guy has. Munch, munch, burp. Hey, perfect timing. Do you want to go get something to eat? I can hear my poor stomach crying, sadly. All right, let's go. Wonderful, my gourmet friend. Let us set forth on our culinary adventure. Today we'll have some delightfully juicy meat at the strip mall that's pr practically exploding with flavor. And that can only mean one place. You have a pretty good appetite. <laughs> you even kept up with me. <clears throat> How do you stay so thin, though? <laughs> Looks really are deceiving, aren't they? Well. <sighs> That means there are people out there who secretly want to take my title as gourmet king. Eh, maybe. Maybe not. Remember that puny middle-aged guy from the other day? I bet he was an assassin. What? There's nothing I can do about it right now, but I'll show them soon enough. An assassin. Right. In light of your recent achievements and your courageous appetite, I hereby appoint you to the gourmet king's royal guard. What? No, maybe that's too much of a burden for you to bear. A burden. I really don't want to guard you. At all. You can guard yourself. It's not hard. Just stay out of trouble. That is what you must do. By the way, you're a second year, right? So you're one year below me. Mm hmm. It kind of feels like I have a younger brother now. Ew. Well, would you want to be my younger brother? Not really, no. Nah. Sure, fine, whatever. I just thought you looked like someone is all, but I was wrong. You look nothing like him. <laughs> Whew, I knew this would happen. I always get hungry if I think about the past too hard. And I just filled up on that beef bowl, too. Better stay true to form and keep eating, huh? Here's to a healthy appetite courtesy of remembering the past. The old memory rewind. Uh, right, now in reverse. Let's moonwalk. Oh, no. Oh, my gosh. Oh, what is going on? You're my royal guard. You have to join me. I didn't now, say I was joining, you, but... Moonwalk into Umiyushi. No. Yeah, I need to part ways with him quickly. He's gonna get on my nerves. For real, for real. All right, it's time. Let's get going. Okay. Should we talk about this some more? I still think this is a bad idea. How are you scared of ghosts, but totally fine with this? Exactly. Cause stuff you can't see is way creepier. Eh. Actually, I'm more worried about the things I can see, like bats and knives. <laughs> Big deal. So it's a little dangerous. A little. Let's strike while the iron's hot. Nah. Strike. Ah, uh, what a pain. Huh? Let's just follow Yucatan's lead, I guess. No oh boy. This I don't like this, but we're gonna do it. Let's get it done. Go. You guys going out at this hour? I don't know what you're up to, but just avoid going anywhere dangerous. Precisely. Are all three of you heading out together? Just take care not to get injured. Okay. Um, hmm. 
the hell are you kids doing out here this late? You delinquents keep loitering in the wrong places, getting up to God knows what. Whichever one of you gang wears the heavy clothes to cover his tattoos, tell him I got my eye on him. Now scram, I'll call the cops. Oop. Oh, it's the dream team. Sheesh, you guys are always together. What's up? Hold on, you're not really going to Port Island Station right now, are you? Haven't you heard a report? It's super unsafe. Oh, boy. Wait, seriously? Man, going to a place like that this late at night is not so easy for a stand-up guy like me. Jeez. Would you stop complaining already? It'll be nothing. What has she got to prove? My gosh. All we have to do is take the monorail to the station. What's so hard about that? That's not exactly what I meant by not easy. You know, Yucatan, you might actually be scarier than the punks we're bound to run into. <sighs> oh my gosh, and we went in our school clothes. Oh no. Check out those rags. They're from Gecko High. Oh man. This is even worse than I thought. You must have taken a wrong turn. This place ain't for you, buddy. Uh, well, I... What I'm seeing is, being here is ruining our vibe. No, oh, no. The vibe. Go tea? Oh, no. Oh, do you need me? We don't need your permission to be here. Hey! No, oh, she's nuts. I can read just fine. Come on, don't be intimidated by these punks. What did you just say? She just called us punks. Come on, let's post some pictures that'll make her daddy cry. Hope you've been practicing your sexy poses. Oh no. <laughs> Are scum. Oh, so now no. we're scum. Man, I feel sorry for you, goatee. This bitch is a real pain in the ass, isn't she? Oh no. Dang it. What did you think was gonna happen? sure they leave you good with that who do you think you are dumbass then i'm walking out of this you want some too oh uh, shit. son of a bitch she's crossed the line you think you're going home alive now should we find out Aragaki, right? Yeah. Now I remember. Shinjiro Aragaki. You're from Gecko High too, aren't you? Damn it, you're gonna regret this. Mm. Oh man, Senpai, that was awesome. Oh gosh. I remember you. You guys were in Aki's room at the hospital. You idiots. Go home. You don't belong here. Wait. Sorry, but there's something we need to know before we leave. Did Aki tell you to come here? Hmm? No, he didn't. <laughs> well, what do you want to know? Is this about that ghost story? Yeah. Yes, that's right. How'd you know? The rumor's been going around. Hmm. Those girls who wound up in the hospital were here talking shit every night. They brag about all the stuff they did to some girl named Yamagishi. Oh. Yamagishi? You mean Fuka Yamagishi from 2E? You were picking on her? That's 
why people are saying it's Yamagishi's ghost that did it. Yamagishi-san's ghost? Wait, what do you mean by that? You guys don't know? Hmm? This Yamagishi girl might be dead. Oh. I heard she hasn't been home in over a week. Wait, what? I thought she was just out recovering. So, you mean she's still missing? So much for that ghost story. Ah. Mr. Akota is the homeroom teacher for 2E, right? Does he know about this? I get it, Aki. Still trying to make up for the past. Hmm. It's you who can't let go. Hmm? Huh? Nothing. Anyways, it's all I know. You done here? Yeah, totally. Thanks a lot. Come on. Show some appreciation. You literally saved ya. Thanks. I didn't do nothing. Thank you for helping us. And for sharing what you know. That was really nice of you. Huh? Oh, uh... Look. Sorry. Just don't come here again. Hmm. Dude, I'm drenched in cold sweat. But man, what Aragaki-san told us was shocking, huh? Oh. I'll let Kirijo-senpai know what we found ab about Yamagishi-san. The fact that she's still missing is no small matter. Man, we're totally gonna get yelled at for doing that without permission. I can already see it happening. Oh boy. What, I gotta break the news? Uh, just wanted to chat. Yamagashi, uh, Yamagishi has disappeared. It began with a ghost story, but it has developed into a serious situation. We have to do something. Give me a break. Seriously, going to a place like that, there are limits to how reckless you can be. I mean, I'm proud of you guys for trying to gather information, but be a little more careful next time. I told you it wasn't a good idea to go there, dude. If Aragaki-san hadn't helped us, who knows what would have happened to us. Ugh, I'm getting an ulcer just thinking about it. I said I was sorry. I didn't think it would be that bad. Well, now you know. Next time, have a little more faith in what I say. Anyways, there's no way in hell I'm ever setting foot in that place again. Yeah, this is your fault. That guy looked kind of scary, but he was actually really nice, don't you think? You think so? I mean, he wouldn't have saved us if he wasn't a nice guy, right? At the very least, I don't think he's a bad person. So why does he seem like he's trying to act like he is? <sighs> that could have been real bad. Yeah, that could have just been real bad. All right, so I think I'm going to call it there. So let's switch to the bedroom, y'all. Zoom. All right. So thank you very much, everyone, for watching. I appreciate you. Uh, what I might do is I might do some uh, some leveling and stuff and uh, prep up. But I appreciate it all. Thank you very much. Um, make sure you click that follow button if you haven't already. Next week, remember... Uh, Tuesday through Thursday, we're doing charity streaming for gamers outreach to try to bring video games to kids in hospitals. So that will be very cool. It is their uh, HP for heroes. So we're also going to be, um, you know, doing it to honor those who take care of those kids, the nurses in the hospitals as well. So it'll be a really chill time. We'll have a lot of fun. But yep, I am going to go for now. Um, there might be some weekend streams, possibility. So make sure you follow just in case there are. And I appreciate y'all. I hope you have a great rest of your evening. And take care of my dears. Bye.